This would be considered my miniatures table. I have a little horizontal and a little vertical double acting steam engine with a piston valve. There's a one cent piece for size comparison. Next is a model of a Marine copied off of the Stuart twin launch engine with reverse. Next is an oil can that somebody had put the drawings on one of the forums and I had built four of them, a couple for my sons and one for a friend. Next up is a carburetor that was, the drawings were made by Lee Root or it was designed by Lee Root and the drawings were published in Strictly IC. So I built the carburetor but volume wise it was a little bit too big for any of my engines. Next up is a triple expansion of my own design. I basically started out with the Stuart twin launch, tw the Stuart compound launch, and then calculated the volume for the third low pressure cylinder. It's complete with the reversing mechanism. Next up is a two inch scale Pickering Governor. This was built for one of the Sureline contests that they used to have at the name show. Next up is my version of the small hit and miss drawings that were published on one of the modeling forums. I started out with the horizontal, then made it into a true hit and miss, then made my version of this vertical, but all were based on that original design. This next one is similar to the original, but with this one here, I converted it into a side shaft engine with all the hit and miss governor mechanism. It has a 3 8 bore and a half inch stroke. Next up is my miniaturized version of the model engine maker Corliss engine. I took the drawings and scaled them down by one half. The smallest fasteners, nuts and bolts in it are 0.8 millimeters. The next engine is the Maudsley Marine engine. All the drawings were also published on one of the modeling forums. It was originally built by Chuck Fellows and here again I scaled it down 
and then made a set of helical gears to operate the governor. Next up is a miniature of the Mary Beam engine. This also was an entry in the Sherline contest many years ago. Behind that is a half scale model of a Colt black powder revolver and a miniature Gatling gun. In the front is a small vertical double acting steam engine with reverse It was based on the Stuart number no. four and then shrunk down to fit the contest guidelines for Sureline. This is another version, a horizontal with a working governor that actually controls the throttle. and a twin behind these engines is a miniaturized version of my large one inch scale case traction engine. This one was also an entry in the Sureline contest. You can see the penny for a size comparison. And then I built the baler based on the larger one, the one inch scale one that I had built. These, this baler and traction engine are approximately 143rd scale. Over here I have my miniature Holt tractor engine. I took the original Holt drawings and scaled them down by one half and then made it into a three cylinder. And the last couple of items are miniature rifles and pistols. The first being a model of the Man Liquor sporting rifle. This is in one third scale, made of brass with walnut stock. This is a Winchester 94 lever action, the same scale, one third. And then a half scale Peacemaker, a Colt, single action army, 45 caliber. So this is my miniature table.